Yo, what's up everybody? It's me, KB. And in this video, I'm going to trying out the new browser called the Edge browser. Oh, what? You have heard about this? No, you haven't, okay? <laughs> because they have changed the logo of the new Edge, which is based on Chromium. And new logo kind of feels and looks funny. Okay, okay. <laughs> So the thing is, how I feel about this new logo is that Edge and Chrome got married and now they have a baby. Chrome Edge. Chrome Edge. Yeah, the baby name is Chrome Edge. And yeah, that's it. That's how I feel about the new logo. <laughs> okay, now let me know your thoughts about the logo of new Edge browser of Microsoft. Okay, so I'm just gonna try it out and gonna see what's new and what's better in Chrome Edge. Okay, getting a new Edge browser. All right, I'm excited. The <laughs> baby of Edge and Chrome. I like it. I don't know, that's how I feel about the new logo. To my eyes, like I don't know, it just doesn't feel that good or great for a browser the old edge e was better to be honest because now it feels like they have stolen the logo of chrome still it looks like a e but you know and they are also pointing you can see this is the e they should have put the chrome in the middle like e plus chrome equal to this chrome edge baby that would be funny <laughs> actually that is reality okay get started import from the google no i'm not gonna import nothing from the informational so let's just read some news nice done all right so enough making fun of it because of the logo i don't like the logo no 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 and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below so i will put link in the description you can go there and try out this new edge browser with the new logo and uh, yeah that's it now i'm going to show you a few of the things what edge can do better than chrome okay so first now for those people like who doesn't like to use the chrome for some reason but they want the browser just like a chrome which can do all the things like this is the browser you are looking for because this is basically a Chrome but developed by Microsoft and it might not look like a Chrome but it can do all the things what Chrome can do. Okay, that's it. Now I'm going to show you a few of the settings. Okay, so the most talked feature about this new Edge is the privacy and services option here you have a tracking prevention option so it can block the uh, tracking things from the websites like for example your history search you know how you get the personalized ads because you know they know what you're browsing and what you're you know trying to search so let's say for example you're searching for a car and there is a chance that next time you visit the other site, you will get the ad of car because you searched for the car and uh, now you are getting the personalized ad. So that's how the thing works. But this Edge browser claims to, you know, make it minimal. Like there is a chance that it will completely stop those things like personalized ads, contents, you know, you can read the description about the settings here we have the basic balance and strict so actually i will also put link in the description for the video official video where developer talk about the new edge browser there you will easily understand this thing because i'm bad at explaining okay so this is the first thing what this uh, browser have but chrome doesn't have and another thing right away is the settings. The settings are separate and well organized 
and since the settings are separate which means we can easily access them but in chrome it's pain in the ass really it's like you just have to scroll down all of the settings are tiny and i don't know how you feel but to be honest settings in chrome edge is better yes <laughs> yeah that's basically it so this edge browser is just a chrome but built by microsoft so there will be some features better than the chrome in edge and there will be some features better in chrome than the edge so that's how it's gonna be but the web contents and experience in web browsing and all that kind of stuff will be similar because this is a chromium based browser i'm gonna go and turn on the dark theme yay i don't know if it's gonna affect the web content too no it's not actually in google chrome you can make web content black dark theme too so i don't know if you can do here in edge mm, i may have to do the research but for now it's not possible maybe i don't know so yeah that's it this is the new edge browser the baby of edge and the chrome chrome edge okay i say that because i don't like the logo i don't know it, it looks like a half chrome since this looks like a e then half e so this is a chrome edge the baby of edge and chrome <laughs> that's how i feel to be honest about this new logo i don't like the new logo that's it hope you enjoyed it guys i don't want to take a long time now just let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what do you think about this new edge browser to be honest this is a good browser um because this is a chromium based and it can do all the things what chrome can do and uh, maybe in future i'm sure there will be lots of people using this browser because you know there was a time when people used to use the microsoft internet browser because that was the only browser at that time and now the majority of people use the google chrome because it's best for everything and uh, yeah there will be people using this browser now because it's it, it just a chrome maybe people need a alternative to chrome so yeah bad news for chrome because you know if some people don't like the chrome then they can easily switch to this chromium edge so yeah i'm not gonna talk too much yeah that's it hope you enjoyed it i will put a link in the description for this you can go there and try out the new chrome edge and yeah that's it i will see you in the next one take care yourself and have fun bye bye